Hey guys, Jargon Airbender here, back with another How to Cannon episode. Today we're going to do left shooters. I'm just going to show you how to add it onto another cannon. So, right here I just got a normal 100 stacker. No, 140. Never mind. Okay, so basically you're just going to have to have a little open area over here. So, let me move this back real quick. Just do this. Stack two. And just delete this so now that I got this big open area I can actually build stuff here I can add in the left shooter so what you're gonna do is right here most cannons have this little block right here where nothing goes so you can just add, you can just add in the left shooter right there real convenient just do that you actually the glass back just do that. I'm gonna knock out all this part. You're gonna add one, two, three, four, five, six. Now there are different ratios you can use, but this one seems to work the best for me. So we're just gonna do that. And you're actually gonna miss that one. So it's six, six, twelve, then four or five. So that's, I don't know what it is. I don't feel like doing math. Even though it's very, very simple. So it should look like this. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put redstone in right here. Like that. Then you're gonna do it on the other side. So it, it's powering both of these layers. Then you just gotta do that, right there. You're gonna power this. You're just gonna hook this straight up to this, like that. Put on an extra tick. Because if you don't have this go off after this, what will happen is once this goes off, it'll actually like scramble all this TNT. Like if we had a line of TNT here, like this, this TNT would like shoot it upwards and like you'll spray all over the cannon yeah you don't want that okay so now you got this you just put a redstone there yeah. hmm. actually we could just yeah there we go that's better you can just do this so you see they both got they both go off at the same time this one tick for this then this goes through this one tick powers all that You're gonna come in here, remove any realigner because I'll just mess it all up. Add these two dispensers. These are gonna be like the separation one where it separates the hammer and the sand more. It's, I think it's four. Yeah. One, two, bam. Something like that, I think. Yeah. I'm just gonna wire this up so it pushes it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now for your hammer, you're just gonna change this up to one, two, three. So you're just gonna change it up to ten ticks, like that. Two full and one half. You're gonna do it to this. Same thing to the other side. Now this, this is what some people forget to do. Just gotta hook up this a little bit farther. Let's see. Like that. This at uh, the sand has to fall before it. Let's actually add one more. Because if you don't, it'll do like order of entities and kind of fusion in a way. You know, mess up. All, like half of the stack will just go straight down. Half of it will go to the side. So you need it all to fall at the same time, or before everything else goes off. The second thing you want to do is you kind of add a little bit more delay on your hammer. Not You don't need to add too much, just a little bit. 
There we go. Then, oh yeah. You're gonna need to come in here, knock out all that, put slabs. So the slab goes for this, the slab bus, the sand, and the little separation thing. And then the actual left shooter part and the hammer are just on a normal block. So what you're gonna do, you're just gonna have to go to the wall. Build a wall like that. Just Let's do this real fast. Okay. Now a cool thing you can do with this one is you can actually left shoot on on filters. So like you can left shoot filters, which I know some cannons can't really do that. There we go, let's fill up sand. And this should hopefully work per shot. DT2020. I'm not really sure. Ah, oh, yeah, it's a TNT fill. I'm still used to just cannons, T DT dispenser tools. So make sure everything's good. Looks good, so we can just go ahead and. Fu oh, wait. Forgot to hook up this. Sorry. Just do that. There. There we go. One, two, three. Move the button over there. Yeah, that looks better. You can go ahead and fire. As you see everything worked pretty well. Everything's going off. Oh. oh, yep. Damn. Slab busts. You can make it uh, instant hybrid. You just have to. Get, you're just gonna have to mess with like. The hammer ratio and timings and stuff. Wait, let's see if it might. Yeah. Let's see if it will actually. Ah, no, it didn't. But yeah, uh, I will show you in another way. So as you see. As you see, this did go uh, shoot over here and destroy a little bit up there. I do know one, if you don't like it up there, I guess. I don't know why you wouldn't, but oh, I'll show you a different way. Here's what I used to use, and it's okay, I guess. It works. The only downside to this ratio of left shooting power is it doesn't shoot as high up and sometimes it's helpful that it shoots a little higher up see it shot way down there you can still shoot through it i just don't think it is as good in my opinion see that works This one works a little bit better. And you can also, like, destroy, so, uh, filter with it. So if we had filters like this. Let's break that off. You can also actually left shoot off the filters. So if you only had one block, like that, you could still left shoot. It's pretty cool. Because I know some you can't. Yeah. Oh. oh. A little bit of lag, I think. Did I forget to do something? I feel like it's lagging. I'll try that again. 
maybe. Uh, uh, actually turn on animations. There. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Yeah, you see there? Work perfect. I think the other one was just a little awkward shot. And it'll work the same for if you had offset filters like this. Yep, see it? Bam, and then you can just fire right through those. I'm not really sure if this can actually regen bust though. I've never tested. But, you know, maybe you can. Maybe you can. Uh, I don't know why that didn't blow up the wall. But, as you see, it does work. But you can put this onto most cannons. You can do a 40 stacker, any really. It's pretty useful. People think it's pretty complicated. I don't know why. It's real simple. Just add this thing on, mess with a few timings, have your sand fall before, and it's all set. You can just fire, left shoot most bases, bypass a bunch of walls, because that's what these are used for. And thanks for watching.